The Supreme Court has upheld its February 13 judgment that sacked David Leon as the duly elected governor of Bielsa State. The appeal was filed by the All Progressives Congress APC. Justice Amina Anuge, who read the judgment of the seven-man panel of the court, held that the application lacked merit. She added that the applications are frivolous and vexatious and awarded the cost of 10 million naira against the applicants. Justice Aoge said, quote, there must be an end to litigation. Even if we review this judgment, every disaffected litigant will bring similar applications and the finality of the Supreme Court's judgments will be lost. Please, I'm warning politicians, Nigeria does not belong to you alone. Don't destroy our country. Don't destroy our country. If you try to destroy our country, God will destroy you. Please don't destroy our country. Amen. You see, this judgment today has reestablished the finality of the position of the Supreme Court and judgments of the Supreme Court. And we are happy the judiciary has indeed redeemed itself. Because if this judgment had not been, or this case had not been properly managed, as we said in court, this could have opened the floodgate to endless and edgeless applications. There would be no end to litigation. Once a court has had a matter and has had it on its merit, and has come to the end, that court becomes what we call functus official. You cannot come back and reopen. Just like the court said, then if any party is ruled against, you come and uh, uh, come for a review, even before the same court, you continue and it will not end. And there will be no limit to the number of times you come for review. So we are very happy because this is the kind of judgment that will stabilize the polity, that will stabilize the judiciary, and indeed, guarantee and sustain the democracy we are trying to nurture in this so country. Total... It would have been scandalous if the court had acceded to the request to review and change its judgment two weeks after it was delivered. Because if we are so, you will find that even judgments that were delivered 10 years ago will be brought back to this court to be changed. And then what will then be the motive of the court for changing its judgment just after delivery? No court in the world, no final court, let me add that, no final court in the world does that. Nigeria cannot be an exception. It's never done anywhere in the world. Our um, thanks and appreciation and gratitude will always go to this great God that we always have, who has vindicated me and the position that we took, who has shown once again his deep love for the people of Bielsa and the John Nation. As you all know, there was no election in Bielsa that the APC and their candidate won. It was a high-level federal conspiracy with collaborators from my party, those who aided and abetted and compromised to give legitimacy to one of the greatest political robberies